Hi, I'm Shannon Heaton, and I'm here to show you just one tune. All you need is your instrument or even your voice alone and a bit of focus. A few years ago, I taught a variant of this tune, the Spring Well. So there are a lot of notes that are similar um, with what is often known as the Kesh jig. But here's the straight up Kesh jig, the one that is well-traveled and well-liked and played at sessions often. It's a good one to know if you're looking to play with other people. I'll play it twice around and then I'll break it down phrase by phrase for easy learning. One, two. <laughs> So just a little bit of melodic variation in there from one time through to the next, um, but basically a straightforward version. And now I'm going to keep it even more straightforward as I break it down phrase by phrase. I'll play a phrase and give you just enough time to sing it back. That's a great way to learn a tune. Really get it in your ear, get it in your heart, and then you'll just know it and carry it onto your instrument probably with ease. So here it is, phrase by phrase. One, two. That's the first phrase. And the way that I approach it is to roll my G, then cut my G, roll my A, cut my A. So that we get the rhythm, the foot rhythm of that way the fingers can dance out the rhythm. So again, one, two. So now that second phrase, I just tongue the second D when you have those repeated Ds. Or you could go, da, da, cut. Da da cut da da do do instead of tonguing, or you could use a glottal stop. Da ah da ah da da. Pick your way. So here's that second phrase again. One two. Ah 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 ah. That was with the glottal stop. Okay, I said I'd teach it to you phrase by phrase. I did a little technical breakdown there. Here it is, phrase by phrase from the top again. One two. A part again. That's the A part, the first part of the tune, twice around as it is played. You notice that the third part, the third phrase is the same as the first, but instead of rolling, I did a little breath. Dum, da, 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 instead of da, 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 da. Builds in a little bit of variation into the tune and it allows you to play it without running out of air in an awkward place. Here's the B part of the tune, phrase by phrase. 
Again. So that fourth phrase, da da la da 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 B G F G. Sometimes I might play. Da da la da 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 A G F G. I think is even more elegant without going all the way up to the B. That's kind of a thing that I like to do sometimes. So there are a few ideas and a few little technical tricks in the cash jig. Hope you enjoy it. Looking forward to playing it with you in person maybe someday. That would be great, wouldn't it? Or on the virtual guided session one of these days. Thanks a lot and hope to see you here next month at the Tune of the Month.